So Sven IO obviously broke in this patch, and Noltail, one of the best IO players ever. Secret. They need a buffer boy with Empower. Uh, Matu could play pretty much anything buffer boy. He can even play um, Ember if he wants to. I like Ember a lot here because it's flexible with mid as well. Uh, very strong, solid pick, I'd say. And yeah, they go for an Underlord. Uh, S4 showed that Underlord was at least strong versus uh, Omni Sven earlier today. He did really well versus Omni Sven. So it should pretty much be the same versus Io Sven. A lot of those classic uh, heroes is good against Sven. Instant Beastmaster pick by OG. Seb said, give me Beastmaster. I couldn't even do a French accent. Said, give me Beastmaster. They got Beastmaster Willow lane, that's a strong lane. They picked Edge. Okay, so that means actually it's, they committed to Magnus mid. Alright. And now OG know that. Dobson could pick something like a Monkey King. I think they're definitely going to ban that out on Secret right now. For sure. They should ban out Monkey. I think Monkey is by far the best one that's left. So they sh if they don't ban it, I think OG are going to pick it. There's the ban. Um, OG themselves need to ban whatever they're afraid of. I don't think it's Ember anymore. So what is OG's response? They ban Viper, of course. That makes sense. Since they have a ban on Viper, Ursa's ban, okay. Every tops and heroes like gone. Ursa Spirit even. <laughs> like I don't know what's left. Every hero here is a Topson ban. Like what the fuck? Ember maybe? Bristle back. Okay. Here we go, boys. That's a that's a new one, kinda. Topson. Let's see. This could be a huge disaster or it could be a banging success. Let's, I'm I'm down to see, dude. Your thoughts on the OTV drama, Pef I don't even know. There, I don't even know there was trauma. What's OTV? Isn't uh, that offline TV? That's the Pokemon people. I didn't know there was drama. So, wow, I've never seen anybody do this. So, okay, so let's try think about this. So he put a sentry here, guys. He put a sentry. All right, and he denied it to half. So if Seb wants to open the camp, he can hit it. If he doesn't want to open the camp on this lane, he can just leave it there and it's blocked. So he, by hitting it f uh, five times, he gave this, he gave his um, off laner or Seb, gave him an option to open the cap if he needs to. I never really thought, why does anybody do that? But no, but it's, it could be important, you know. We will see. There's no reason not to. Top lane. Uh, Beastmaster doing pretty well here, actually. Way better than Underworld. So that's good for Se OG. I think they're in trouble. Otherwise, they're not doing too well. Overall, this mid lane is really skewing the matchup towards. Um, Towards Secret's favor. Alright, so level 6. Thompson also hit level 6 here. I mean, he can stock the ancients from himself and farm pretty fast, but Magnus does the same thing, but he's better, you know? Like, he's just a better hero. Pretty much, period, right there. Uh, they do have the option as well of separating Wisp and putting him on the um, Seb. Getting a little bit in trouble. We're gonna finally gonna see first blood here. It's close. Oh, Messiah, you had him! Uh, Yapsor gets him, though, and doesn't give away first blood because of it. But I'm pretty sure Zai had the hit there, man. Maybe you guys know me better. Oh, that's pretty nice RP. I think they're gonna get a free kill on Saxa here. Saxa's kinda healthy though, with a big stick and a fairy here. Uh, Nisha's gonna chase for more. He has Shockwave. He gets juked by Saxa. Great jukes. Yep, sir. Does not commit on the kill. Okay, they give up. That's cute. a lot of space for Saxa. RP used. Thompson farming here behind tower. Thompson coming back into the game. Actually ahead of net worth on the Magnus now. Cool. Top lane. They're gonna go up in on Seb. Seb gets double rooted, so he will fall here. That's pretty big. Bot lane mid one actually dies here. Wow. Huge kill for Secret. Huge. Very large. Tax actually stacked for Nisha here. That's nice of him. Thank you. Missed the kill bottom. Pop oh, wait, wait. Puppy just walked up into runes here. He wanted to scout the stacks, but Sven is farming them now. It's a big stack actually. Uh, he does not have great items to farm stacks with. Hey Gore. I've been watching you for over five months now. Oh. I love your stream and your voice is super soothing. Not Keck. It has helped me calm down a lot. Thanks for everything. Keep Thank you streaming. guys. Grounded. That's a five dollars, man. My chat ends up flaming armor. Can you guys? Can you guys be nice sometimes? You know, when someone sends a wholesome message, can you guys just have a you know, have a, give him a heart, you know, or something? Just be nice, you know. Yeah, it's fine to send a wholesome message. A lot of people do. This is cool, man. I appreciate it a lot. Thanks, man. Thanks a lot, dude. Thompson. Oh, he's getting saved by Wiz. Relocate. He's gonna get him out. Oh, wow. That was so close. It's unreal. Unreal close. What a save by Notel. 
That is kind of low here. Can Saxa finish him? No. Hit him a hard push. Be a bit nice. You guys can make fun of me, but don't make fun of my donos and stuff. There, there's, there's people. We can make fun of them a little bit if they're cringe or something, but that was fine. Danny, this is the four months, man. Gorge best gore. <clears throat> oh, I gotta look out for your brothers in chat. Fellow betters. All right. Nisha has skewer here. I don't think they can go for kill, but Puppy's gonna die for sure here. OG are playing really good right now, boys. Look at the tempo. The IO Bristle is fucking online. 2k lead, they're stealing stacks. This is some real OG ass Dota, boys. It's happening. This is serious. Full Crimson. Oh my god, he gets both of the creeps with one single W. Dude, he has no cares. This is what I'm talking This is what I'm talking about, boys. RP's here, he screws him at the tower. Is this gonna be enough? The ult? Oh my, don't tell me he lives. Don't tell me, don't you dare tell me he lives. Okay, good. Yeah, that would be crazy. But look at this, OG are using the space to take stacks. They're using it to take top tower. Really big still, Thompson's just making space. I feel like they're, look at, the, look at the amount of the map they're controlling on OG here. They're controlling this part. I don't know if you guys can see me, but they're controlling all of this. All of this. So the only things you could confirm are three camps here and their triangle. OG have like five more camps. Wait, someone else is circling stuff. Who the fuck is- who circled this? That wasn't me. Someone else do something? It's a ghost. The fuck? Who was that? <laughs> I don't have- I don't have spectator chat on, I don't have anything on. I'm gonna give him a question mark. Is anybody- anybody here? Hello? Uh, oh, okay. OG going it. for the bounty steal actually, they have all four bounties. Good. Huge! They know that with Bristle standing there, secret to no one to contest. I have a feeling Thompson's gonna TP top right now. I actually have a feeling. Is he doing it? No, they're actually going- oh, never mind, they're going high ground bottom. Okay, okay, that's way better. Alright. I thought he was just gonna go in 1v4 here or some shit like that. Uh, he needs to be here in case they turn. Atos is here. Middle's a bit separated, he starts reloading him out. Is it in time? Oh, just barely, wow. No BKB on uh, mid one. Does this mean that Secret can fight this? I think not, because they don't have haunt. So OG use this right away. No haunt. Go rush, and they're rushing, just like that. And Halberd soon done on Thompson. Sven is going for AC, so all the physical damage will be pretty much gone on Secret. They're gonna rely on magic only. And here's the reload. The Absor tries to TP, but he does get feared. Easy kill for Thompson. You got the Aegis on Thompson actually instead of the Briss and uh, instead of Sven. It makes sense though. Nisha's trying to slink by here. Seb finds the Spectre though. Can Spectre get out of here? He has a Stomper as well. Oh, here's mid one. Can they're trying to get Spectre out? He's trying to TP. It's a good TP. It's a great TP. But Nisha is in big trouble now. He cannot get out that easy. He should have TP'd also. Honestly, he wasn't aware. He did not, was not as good as Matu, realizing he need to TP right away. I don't think it was cooldown. Dobson? I question this bristle pick. I'm not gonna lie, boys. I question it. What the fuck are they doing, you know? But hey. It's working pretty good. Pretty fucking good. Matu, getting slammed a bit. Da -da -da, da -da 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 -da. Thompson has Aegis here, so he doesn't mind it getting popped. Nautil's gonna heal him up a bit. Pretty good jump by Zai. They do root, skewer and Thompson, Aegis is gone. That's pretty good so far. Will Nautil try to reel him out? Wow, Nautil is so under farm by the way. Eight creep kills only. Don't think he's gonna bother even. Thompson is just fine in here. He's so tanky. Halberd. Sen is starting to start hit the tower here. They're kinda low on OG though. They could fuck up here. There's a skewer. Skewers him away from the thing, and now they're gonna commit on Thompson here. Can they get him is the question. Yes, they can. But Rax is gone, guys. Mid one BKB TP's here. I got the root on uh, Willow at least. So they do get another kill, but yeah, not that great. Leaving kill for Spectre, that's good. He needs his Radiance, he's getting closer. Radiance will make a small difference at least. But now, finally, 23 minutes in the game, not the earliest for a Spectre with uh, Empower. Radiance is finished. This is the, what Secret were kind of waiting for. 
but it's looking really, really rough, boys. I'm not sure. Going straight on Bristle, slowing him down. Blade mill popped. Mid one pops BKB. It's not so, maybe the best BKB commitment if they get Mato out here. They don't. So Zai is a bit late with the ulti. Worked out for OG really well. So that's huge. No Radiant Spectre now. Can they hold for enough time? I don't know. Do have some good spam spells. They have four four heroes that can spam long range. Look at Thompson. He's just getting poked down. He's annoyed. The Dragonlance of Puppy was pretty smart after all. He's doing a lot of damage. There's the net. Stops him. I gotta sneeze soon. Go. Oh, the skewer back. They separate him from Wisp. Wisp has tether though. Is he gonna tether in? Yeah, he will tether. He's in, in a pretty bad spot, but they have nothing to stop him. Okay. Spectre is back. Can OG are having a little bit of trouble sieging high ground. Uh, Roche is up in two minutes, so they might want to wait for that. An Aegis on Thompson would be or more like three minutes. Would make it safe. But they still want to keep the pressure up and not let them farm, so they're gonna play their areas like mid one is doing here. He has a finished AC, so what does he have to be afraid of? Let's see. They wanna slow down the push here on Zai tries to TP. The root is there though, beautiful by Saxa. Tries to TP or an underworld, but nah, he's not that tanky, dude. He's not that tanky, he's just dead. Okay then. Here we go. No Underlord. This is gonna slow down their push quite a lot. Let's cure in. They wanna fuck with Thompson a bit, but look how little damage he's taking. Oh my. Meanwhile, mid one is going for objectives with Solar Crest and Ulti. No Tail saves this boy Thompson for a little bit. Haunt is here. No Tail's kinda low. He's dead. Thompson's next. Oh no, no. Can they go for more? Mid one is just going for Raxus here. He has no cares. Could be good. Yeah. Io buys back. Okay, ta Thompson. Ah, it's fine. The boar, they're all chasing the boar. Puppy with the micro notel is back now. They have no. Oh, can they chase here? Maybe. 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 Secret. They get a kill on Zep. Okay. Okay. Good. Good for Secret. Okay, they're gonna go a bit on Thompson, skewered back, but does he care? I mean, they have RP, they're gonna go for it. Velo is here, can he make it to the save? Mechboy is here, Matu's just gone, wow! The Chad mid one is here, with a silver edge, instantly breaks and destroys Matu. Thompson was just a bait. Skewer him back, they will kill him here, it looks like. Yep. Ooh. Okay, dude. That's some fucking power right there, bro. Silver Edge. It's a rough one, guys, but I see a way out for Secret. I see a way out. 2% says Gabe. I think it's slightly bigger. They have a good chance. Oh, yeah. That's a lot of damage. Things like this. No BKB on mid one here. Can they actually kill him? Net. Everybody look at how kited is being. The Haunt in. A little bit bad dagger by Matu. The, the ulti, mid one is fighting without ulti and without BKB here. He's getting healed, but he's not doing damage. In five seconds, he has BKB though. Instantly break Spectre though. Can he kill him? They're trying to finish mid one. Just got BKB back. That's scary. That's scary. That's scary. He's gonna man up, but he can't. Wisp is here. Ooh, okay. Um, they went all in on that one, but they're not getting him. It's so close. Oh, GG. There it is, boys. I was way too close, dude. I was so fucking close. Big surprise, guys. The outcome of this game is a big surprise. Secret like, yeah, we're Team Secret. We're Team Secret, they're fucking Team Secret. And all of a sudden OG just starts playing behind their towers with like a bristleback. And they just lose all control of the game. And it was a steady decline all, all the way from there, man. Yeah, that was fucked up, dude. Alright, well played by OG, honestly. They're back. They're actually back. They played super well that game. Let's go um, change the text. OG won. 33% chat. Only 33% were right. If there were, there were bets open, there would be big big rewards for the believers. Alright, here we go. What is happening here? So, Voice Spirit, uh, Luna, 
Uh, Slardar, okay. So what is the ultimate last pick for top boy here? Wait, they could be silencer mid, honestly. Ah, uh, it could be silencer mid. They're looking for a carry, probably, right? TB looks really big. TB's not banned. Um, good. It's semi-ranged also versus with clock. That's a really good TB game. I would say TB straight up. Let's see what they go for. None of those. They go for Sven. All right. I don't even like Sven here. Sven is not even that nice or slarder, but they feel comfortable, so. Oh, whoa. Hold up. Tops and Sven. All right. If I was opening bets, I was probably gonna go on secret here, I'll be honest. But hey, I don't know, maybe it'll surprise. Tops and Sven? Didn't we see this one time and it was an absolute disaster mid? What is this? Did Tops and really run out of heroes? on? Tops and... Boy, that was a, such a weird one. The mission period of one minute? Cheat by watching the Orinial stream XD. Fuck, I can't. Error creating, I can't. I don't know what's going on. Ah, Alright, I can't do that, sorry. We're just gonna have to watch. Oh, I didn't leak, I didn't leak anything. Let me see my history, if I leaked something. No, I didn't leak anything. It's just a bunch of Geo Guesser and stuff. Look at that. Bye. Well, I missed the first blood, that's fucking leaked out of here. Top lane, first blood, sick. No tail gets it, that's to it. For mid one too? Wow, that's really big. So how are they gonna lane this? They're gonna lane tops and mid? They will. So Sven versus... They're gonna lane a safe lane silencer. It's actually kind of good versus this, uh, the slaughter, I can imagine. But they're actually putting slaughter bottom? Wait a second. Yeah, yeah, okay. Luna tri lanes are really strong though. They need to watch out. Luna tri lanes are really strong, chat. He's blocking no tail. No tail. Can't tuck tail and run. You don't have one. Okay, they got the kill. Misses maybe one or two creeps for this though. PA Battle Fury is very strong. I think if they nerf Battle Fury, PA is still gonna be strong. I think they need to change the concept of the hero or something. Maybe a little bit. I mean, it's being first banned in pro games. It feels wrong. It should never be that strong. Mid one, a little bit in trouble. It cogged up. Getting beamed. He's gonna die here for sure. Easy for Matu. Gets the range creep. Yeah, this is this is brutal tri lane. So that OG are losing on the top lane only right now. But they're bullying Zai out of the lane quite a lot here when three and tier, I bet. Who has an urn? I saw an urn here. Yep, so has an urn. And a charge, they're gonna go straight on Saxa. They have the tag team. Level two tag no level one tag team, I mean. Easy kill for Puppy. Can you explain a good one pot silencer? OGP is picking it. So I think the reason they pick it. Somewhat is at least because it has a pretty decent laning stage and it's not terrible in general, honestly It used to be played as a three. So why can't it be playing as a one? Has utility as well It's just imagine just a right-click hero. That's uh, That's like a Luna, but worse. That's kind of where you get silencer I'm Gonna try to pull here. No tail is stopping it though. He's trying actually they do get the pull Can they get pull it through though? Let's see. No tail's gonna try to stop it. They have beam they do kind of get it, but Clock's here in the backline. Puppy a bit in trouble. I think he's dead here. Yep. Okay, that's a kill. Going for more. Pulling Matu. Wow, wait, wait up. Hold up. Matu dies too? Oh, shit. No TPs. They're going for Thompson, meanwhile, mid. Yep, so trades their lives for the Thompson kill, but I don't know if it's worth it, honestly. It's a little bit of a tricky trade there. Oh, shit. Plus four for Silencer. Let's go, dude. And on his brain is getting bigger. Eight fucking uh, uh, int. Not bad. I watched pretty much every fucking show under the moon, and then you're like, what now? And he's like, fuck it, I'll watch anime. And that was like five years ago or something, right? So I, I've watched a bit, but I haven't watched in a long time now. Uh, Nisha is a little bit in trouble. It's kind of bad if he dies. He's top network. Ooh, nice call ulti. Can they fight this now? Nisha's trying a bit, he's auto attacking. This mid one's Q spell here is super annoying. He's gonna go straight for Seb. He does get the kill. Wow, he's tanking a lot. This is so good. The Thompson is here though. Hookshot misses with the push. That's super unlucky for Saxa. Now mid one is dead and they're cleaning up Thompson too. Oh my god. It's a 4 for 0 trade. Really bad for Secret. What a ulti by uh, Puppy too. Holy shit. Have you watched? No. I've <laughs> watched that one, dude. Oh. OG getting rolled, dude. Holy shit. 
Yeah, that was rough, man. That was rough. They didn't really burst anybody, and they're fighting without global, and I don't think Black Hole matters much when you have so many ways to cancel it right now. Naruto, no, so one thing I have stayed away from when watching anime, guys, I, I advise you guys to do the same. Well, I mean, Naruto is maybe fine or something, but I just haven't watched any of the, like, really fucking long ones that drain your life energy. Like the Naruto, Bleach, and One Piece, they're just like fucking a million episodes. I just, if you get started with that shit, you're stuck in a deep black hole that does, doesn't end, you know, it's too many episodes. Just fucking stay, I stayed away from that shit. I mean, if you watch 700 episodes of anything, it's gonna change who you are, I think. I don't know if no, I want my personality to become more Naruto. I'm just gonna say that. Naruto's getting bigger here, too. Nasark pushing on mid tower here. Bookshot. They're going straight on Puppy. Okay. Can Puppy survive for anything? Thompson is here. Oh no. But wait a second. They get, he gets ulti out. Global is late. Global is late. OG don't know what to do. They're hitting the middle now. They actually find Mato. No, this is good for OG. Okay. Alright, alright. OG is a problem for them. When they have Global, it's hard for a secret to fight right now. That was really good for OG. Brings them back in the game a little bit. Honestly, look at Gabe. 55% for, for for secret only. With a 5k lead. He has big beliefs in OG draft. Okay. I wish I could sub to you, but I don't have any money. That's alright, man. Don't worry about it. Only sub if you want, or if you can, guys. No one is forced to. I'm just kidding. You all have to sub, guys. It's five dollars a month, guys. Five fucking dollars. Come on, guys. What the hell are you doing? I'm just kidding. Nah, it's cool, boys. It's cool. It was a joke. It was a joke. <laughs> I forget what it did. It sounded so serious. Bot lane. I'm gonna jump. <laughs> I'm gonna jump Nisha. Smile. Smiley smile. Thanks. Oh, there's the black hole. Nice global black hole. Two kills. OG are fucking back, dude. What the hell? I thought this game was like over. Let me guess. You Secret can just can't team fight them. But now they have no global, no black hole. Is this a time where Secret can team fight them? Let's see. We're gonna jump Thompson. Thompson has no BKB yet, so he is killable. They do have Greaves. Eclipse is used. It's not hitting anything though. We're gonna kill No Tail, but only No Tail. And look, they're all kind of stuck in this root and midnight pulse shit. And now Zai is dead. Wow, Soji fighting this super well. They find mid one, the mid one is way out of position, he's in big trouble. Do they have any vision? They do, the man up, the madness versus madness. Thompson is victorious, will die now though. Can they go for more? Yeah, this is looking like a good fight for secret, so OG are not that strong without their hole and global. Okay, that's a really good fight for secret. 3-4, wait, did he absorb buyback actually? Yeah, they absorb buyback, so 3-4-5. Five, five. Not bad, and a buyback. Oh, hookshot on Yapsor, that's a good initiate, he doesn't have buyback, he does get snowball off though, look at the back though, Zai jumps uh, with the amp on Thompson, they're gonna try to burst him. The global is there, with the root, everybody's fucked. Can to finish Thompson, he's trying to man up with the lifesteal, he's doing it. But no, Matu ends up victorious, he just mans up right back. Wow. Seven in the back here has black hole. No one to black hole right now though, because everyone's fucking dead. Yep. Has the ring thing? Yeah, they have to jump out. This is scary. Ooh, that could have ended worse, but 3 for 2? I mean, it's, it's a very back and forth game, man. Holy shit. Thank you, Dark Skulls, again, man. OG has really strong BKB timings. Yeah, they do. That's true. I just sneeze. Hookshot misses, global used, Thompson, BKB force, can they kite this though? Let's see. Oh, the block off on Thompson, what a block by Yapsor, beast. Holy shit. They're gonna burst Saxa here it looks like. Except BKBs, he walks in, he wants to hold, he does hold too. That's not bad. They're getting very controlled here on OG though, there's no damage in the hold. There's the Eclipse by Matu, but he's kinda run into the bone zone here, he's a little bit in trouble. He Massive Madness tries to fight, but he's dead. This is not so good. Nisha also died. Wow. Okay. Okay, dude. Matu got a little bit cocky there. Another 4 int for mid one. 46 permanent int, boys. Oh my god. 
He is juicing on the int, boys. He's a real core now. OG are playing so so much better now than they did the past few days. I think they're playing really well versus Secret. And give them credit for that. Not bad, man. Are OG not healing in Willow Wisp? I do feel like they're not hitting it a lot, but they are getting blinded and stunned a lot, so it's annoying. I just... I mean, I don't want to flame Secret, but they are kind of trash. Nah, no, I'm just kidding. But I do feel like Secret in general are not as good at coming back and playing from behind as a lot of other teams. And speaking of, maybe they're doing it now. I feel like they're so used to being ahead, you know? They're so used to fucking owning, owning, owning. 5k lead at 10 minutes, you know? So when they're put in a situation like this, when there's a 1k lead for OG, I feel like they're in trouble, you know what I mean? I just have that feeling. I don't know. They're so used to owning. That's just a feeling, though. I'm not sure if it's accurate. Because I feel like they're in big trouble this game, you know? Like, even though the game is kind of close, it just feels like Secret are on a huge back foot. A Pega. I did a good job. Sacks a hookshot, but it misses. Can they finish him here? Here's Thompson. Does not want to use Beekeeper Mato here. Is he going to Madness away? Doesn't feel like he needs to. Uh, he does BKB in the end. Nope. Does not want to fight this. Thompson did force the BKB. They find a hiding spot. Oh, Nisha. He gets out. Oh, that was close. Only Zydines have all this, and Global is used. They still have the hole. They're not going to hold you up, so here, probably. Midnight Pulse is up. He reflected the Malphys, but did not remove it, so he's still a bit in trouble. He has a snowball. That's an optimistic TP by Yefsor there. Minus four int for you, because that was minus four real life intelligence for trying to TP there, I think. That was a good try, though. And what does he have on mid one? Almost hex, wow, okay. Puppy soon Midas AC Monkers. <laughs> He should be having a Hex coming up soon for Puppy, honestly. That's probably his next item, I guess. Or something like a Abyssal. Nah, it's too crazy. He's gonna Abyssal to Black Hole, uh, enter a Black Hole. Wait, they jump straight on Seb. This is a pretty good target to start on because he's pretty low armor. They force a BKB. Uh, might want to Black Hole here. They do solo Black Hole Nisha. It seems to be working out pretty well. But, is this a fight Secret can take anyways? It looks like they're going up. It's not two BKBs. Reflex a stun on two! Looks like a free kill on Seb. Yeah. Can they get more? Oh, so close. Can they get the to, bow? To he's running. Zai has blink and a stun. He gets it. Amps. BKB on Thompson, though. Tries to fight back. He has AC. Slowing down his kill, and they will get him. Wow, well played by Secret. Well played, dude. Holy shit. Oh, that was close. They, they forced the Black Hole, but the discipline part here is that Nisha didn't buy back. That was really big. He did not buy back instantly after Black Hole. He could have done that, but they didn't need him. They just cleaned up without him. Nisha has BKB soon. All right. Oh, they jumped mid on Mato a bit. He does have Lotus to protect him from the Malefice. There's a Hex on Slaughter. Instant killed. Okay. Time to run, boys. No Slardar. The, the in and out from OG here. Literally just harvesting intelligence. They root Matu, but they can both purge it away, so root was for nothing by Onotail. Didn't waste root. OG's Roche is up in one minute. This is good. Now it's good for Secret all of a sudden, because they have two heroes dead. So lucky them, it's a really slow spawn. But Secret don't know this, so they buy back Yefsor. Max spawn Roche. The problem is two black holes, guys. Two black holes. That shit it ain't easy to handle. I think OG will have an easy fight if they get any sort of decent initiate. Saxa hook hookshot though, that's pretty big. Nisha dodges, they, they, they jump in with Thompson. Oh, Nisha in the back, bad spot, he's hexed. He's dead. Black hole on, only on Yapsur, but it's enough. Like, who cares? It's okay, whatever, you know? No BKB now on Thompson. Can they finally finally fight? There's the Eclipse. Seb has a second BKB here. They do burst him in time. He does use Refresher before he dies too. And Thompson can't fight back. Wait a second. Secret. Beam, they're back. Mid one is dead too. He just like, take me as well, dude. I don't want to live without my team. Wow. Wow. Actually, literal wow, boys. That's insane. Because now they get Aegis. And now the black holes aren't as big of a problem. Okay. Okay, dude. Holy shit. What is going on here? Holy shit, dude. That was so good. Um, because Sep kind of wasted his first black hole. And then by the time he got the second one, he wasn't really ready of them manning up on him. 
and bursting him so he couldn't get the second black hole off. If he just got the black hole on Matu, solely Matu, they would have won the fight. But Matu was sitting back really patiently that fight. It was really well played by Secret, just being patient. And now he has a satanic almost. Okay, dude. How are you gonna deal with this? That's not gonna be easy. Win percent, shooting up again. I'm gonna go for high ground here probably in 20 seconds. No, they could maybe get a Rax at least. Nice kind of cutting trees here, not letting no tail stick around. Uh, okay, they have a glyph, so this might not be so easy to fight. Not might not be so easy to not fight. I mean, uh, to run away. Let's see. They're staying quite long. There's the hook shot. Here we go. Nisha, there's the black hole. Beautiful black hole by Seb. Nisha has no buyback and Matu is dead here. No, this is so bad for OG. Tops and pops BKB literally for nothing though, which is kind of good. Matu BKB starts running, he starts TPing, he gets rooted instantly, did not realize that root, and now he's just fucked. They overstayed their welcome there, they overstayed their welcome so much on OG. I mean on secret, what are they doing? Clumping up, oh my god, here we go, OG is death belling down mid. Is there anything to stop them? They have Coddle, he can slow everything down. Uh, buybacks on Slaughter and Coddle, I believe. Puppy's only died once the entire game. Zai actually solo kills Noltil at the rune. What a play, honestly. Forces buyback. Noltil's a bit mash, but look at this, they're going for... Ooh, the Lotus Reflect. Now Yapsor is in big trouble, he doesn't have buyback. Puppy does, though. Black Hole on two. They have to do everything they can to delay this game. Buyback by him, buyback by Zai. Five alive on OG though, boys. Five alive. No black holes now for a while. Hook shot in the back. On Puppy. He has no buyback. He has a blind soon though. Slaughter jumps in. Forces himself out, but he's dead. Slaughter tries to man up on mid one. He can't. 15 seconds until their core spawn. Thompson? Very low. Very low, dude. What is this game? This is fucking craziest game I've seen in a while, I'm telling you, boys. What the fuck is this? Alright, they're finally up on Matu. Now, Secret OG gonna back off a bit. There's no Roche to take, nothing like that. They have buyback on Sven. They have buyback on Silencer. They have buyback on literally everybody. So they're in a big position to win here. Huge. What a throw, dude. How does Secret actually stay that long on this high ground? So greedy of them. I understand if Matu stood alone, but for some reason Nisha was standing next to him. That was really bad for them. Must have been surprised by the hook shot. Larder mana, lol W. 399. <laughs> oh, his int has been the fucking sucked out of him, dude. They do force his BKB, and the root is out. Thompson, BKBs as well. A little bit weird BKB by Thompson. He's gonna go straight on Nisha. Actually, he's not weird at all. What a what a kill. And now he's manning up on next one. Matu's satanics, but whoa, one big chatty crit and Matu's just gone. Not enough, dude. Okay, bro. Bookshot on Zai. Gonna finish him too. Triple kill. Alright. Damn, dude, what a back and forth game. You gotta be shitting me, dude. Uh, several times I thought Secret had this, but OG turned up. They played well today. They played well. They were, they were on fire today, boys. They were really on fire. The old OG is back. GG called. Thompson gets the last word in even. That was a fun game. <laughs> Not even 400 mana slaughter, dude. Fluked game two. I don't want to call it fluked, but... Secret definitely did give them something, it felt like. They gave it away a little bit. Had a great start on them. Kind of a reminder of game one, but this was even better. I mean, look at Nisha start. He's bodying Thompson mid. And... And uh, top lane is also losing super hard. And it didn't matter. Uh, OG like teamwork their way back through it. Six, look at mid one. We were kind of making fun of his net worth on lane. 16, 4, and 23. He has great stats. And he's been doing good damage in fights as well. Top damage of the game. Almost, except for Matu. Not bad. Very odd. They made the Silencer Sven core lineup workout. Also, we have to know, have to forget the last pick Enigma here. With uh, no black hole councils. I mean, that shit is... So hard to play against. Like, you just sat, sit there and you watch your teammates just get sucked into the hole and die. It sucks a lot, dude. Puppy's getting the machete. 
Well, he's online status right now. Main menu. He's watching. He's watching his teammates. Madu is staying in main menu too. Staring at them. Don't you dare quit Dona, dude. You know what you did. You told me you won your Luna pubs. What is this? I wouldn't want to be Matu right now, boys. I wouldn't want to be him. I wouldn't want to be him, dude. Alright, guys. We fucking made, a f made it through a full stream today, guys. I slept three hours. I'm fucking sick. We made it through. That's good. We had some bit of a questionable solo queue games in the beginning. I was fucking not feeling up to it. Really tired. But we had some good ones uh, to end it on. So that's cool. Two and two.